Hey second graders, welcome to Learning with M. My name is Manika and I'm a former mathematics educator. This is a part of my series Maths with Grade 2. And today I'm going to teach you three digit numbers. Are you ready to learn with them? Let's get started. Let's learn three digit numbers. Before moving to three digit numbers, let's check and revise what you already know about two digit numbers. This is a two digit number 68. How can you represent 68 using base 10 blocks? To show the number 68, we use units and rods. Units are these small boxes that represent ones. Rods are these standing blocks that represent tens. So how many tens and ones are in 68? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There are 6 rods of tens and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. 8 units of 1s, 6 rods of 10s and 8 units of 1s. Excellent! Let's see another 2 digit number that is 9999. The numeral 99 has 9 rods of 10s and 9 units of 1s. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. There are 9 rods of 10s and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. And there are 9 units of 1s. So, what is 1 more than 99? Or what is 99 plus 1? That's right! 99 plus 1 is 100. Did you know that 100 is the smallest 3 digit number? 99 is the biggest 2 digit number. And 100 is the smallest 3 digit number. This is going to come handy, so remember this. Yay! It's time for Fun Facts with M. Did you know that a person who is 100 years old is called a centenarian? That's right. United States and Japan have the highest number of centenarians in the world. Can you believe it? Coming back to 100, we have 9 rods of 10s and 9 units of 1s. When we add 1 more 1s to 99, we have 9 units of 1s plus 1 more. Here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 1 more 1s that is 10 1s. So, 10 units of 1s all together make 1 rod of 10s. Here, you can count 10 small units of 1s, making 1 big 10s. So, the numeral 100 is represented by 10 rod of 10s. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Amazing, right? But wait, <laughs> this does not stop here. 10 rods of 10s put together make one flat of hundreds. That's right. Amazing. So, 100 is shown by one big flat of hundreds. Like this. So, how can we show the numeral 117? Can you guess? 
the numeral 117 is made up of one flat of hundreds one rod of tens and seven units of ones see here it's time for practice now write the three digit number here you have 1 2 and 3 three flats of hundreds and 1 2 two rods of tens and 1 2 3 4 4 four units of ones let's see one more write the three digit number when you count the flats of hundreds you have 1 2 3 4 4 flats of hundreds and how many rods of tens are here let's count 1 2 and 3 there are 3 rods of tens can you see any units of ones here none right so we are going to write zero zero units of ones so the numeral is 430 awesome keep it up we will learn more about three digit numbers in the next video see you later bye bye